Well, finding lost and stray pets could get a whole lot easier next year. Spokane will contract with scraps for animal control, which means all misplaced pets will be found under one roof. KXLY 4's Aaron Luna tells us about the changes to come. With scraps adding the city of Spokane to their area of coverage, they're going to need a bigger facility. They're looking at buying this old Harley Davidson dealership at 6815 East Trent. They say having one central location for pet owners to come and find lost and stray pets will make it easier on everyone. Lose a pet and it could end up in several different shelters. But that's all about to change. The benefits of regional animal control is all strays will be housed under one roof. So if you're missing your pet, you'll come to Scraps and hopefully it will be there. Monday night, the Spokane City Council unanimously voted to give Scraps the contract for animal control services starting in 2014. A contract held for the last 28 years by Spoke Animal. We had a staff meeting this morning and um, everybody discussed about how excited they are to move in a new direction and we're ready to move forward and we've already started taking our first steps. Spoke Animal will lose 60% of its budget and 22 employees. We'll be doing an evaluation of every single one of our programs um, in September and deciding which ones we're going to go ahead with and which one will scale back and which ones will be gone totally. But it's not going to tuck its tail and run. You know, we've been here for the animals for 28 years and we will continue. We'll just be doing it in a different manner. Scraps will now handle animal control for Spokane, Spokane County, unincorporated Spokane County, and any other small city that wants to join the system. Nancy Hill with Scraps says, the move will create a universal licensing code. It will also create a uniform animal control ordinance and uh, standardized policies. Dogs don't seem to know when they've crossed the county line. Picking up the city contract will double Scraps' area of coverage, meaning they will need 20 new full-time employees and six part-time. The building it wants to buy is almost three times larger than the one they have now. Scrap says that it will finalize the deal for this building at the end of the month. Reporting on East Trent, Aaron Luna, KXOY4 HD News.